टुडे विल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट पॉइजन प्रोसेसेस पॉइजन प्रोसेस इज द अराइवल और डिपार्चर प्रोसेस वेयर द नंबर ऑफ अराइवल्स बिटवीन एन इंटरवल से जीरो टू टी रिप्रेजेंट्स द पॉइजन रैंडम वेरिएबल द डेंसिटी फंक्शन फॉर द पॉइजन रैंडम रैंडम वेरिएबल इज गिवन बाय दिस सो पी ऑफ एक्स ऑफ टी इज इक्वल टू के वे के आर इज द नंबर ऑफ अराइवल इज इक्वल टू ई रेस टू माइनस लैमडा टी लैमडा टी रेस टू के बाई के फैक्टोरियल वे के इज जीरो वन टू एंड सो ऑन द सेकेंड प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ ऑफ अ पॉइजन प्रोसेस इज दैट इफ देर आर टू नॉन ओवरलैपिंग प्रोसेसिस से there is a poisson process from 0 to t 0 to t1 where arrivals are like this and that's another poisson process from t2 to t3 where the arrival is like this if they are non overlapping then they are independent so we will be using this to find the Auto correlation of the Poisson process. So first, we'll be finding the mean. The mean of the Poisson process is the parameter itself. So it is lambda t. The variance is also lambda t. So uh, e of x square of t is equal to uh, variance. That is lambda t plus e of x of t is the whole square. That is mean the whole square. So it will be lambda square t square. So e of x square t is lambda t plus lambda square t square. So to find the auto correlation function, so uh, we need to find e of x of t one, x of t two. So to find this. Uh, We will be taking two uh, non-overlapping processes, namely from interval zero to t one and from interval t one to t two. So the expectation for that will be e of x of t one into x of t two minus x of t one. Here the arrival at t1 will be in either the first process or the second process so they are non overlapping and independent so if they are if they are independent then we can write it as e of x of t1 into expectation of x of t2 minus x of t1 but we know that e of x of t1 is equal to lambda t1 And e of x t two is lambda t two and x t one is lambda t one. So this will be lambda t two minus t one. So this is equal to lambda square uh, lambda square t one t two minus t one. This e this expectation e of x of t1 into x of t2 minus t1 x of t2 minus x of t1 can be expanded into e of x of t1 x of t2 which is what what we want minus x of t1 square but we know that e of e of x square t1 is equal to lambda t plus lambda square t square therefore e of x of t1 into x of t2 is equal to This plus this, so that will be lambda t plus lambda square t square, 
and lambda square t1 t2 minus lambda square t1 square this will get cancelled so we get lambda square t1 t2 plus lambda t1 this will be the auto correlation if uh, t2 is greater than t1 but if t1 is greater than t2 then the auto correlation will be lambda square t1 t2 plus lambda t2 so we can write the auto correlation function as lambda square t1 t2 plus lambda minimum of t1 t2